Hello guys, um, with this video we are starting the new chapter uh, what is algebra and algebra is a branch of maths dealing with symbols and the rules for multiplying those symbols and before we start doing some questions we need to learn a few keywords and they are very essential in algebra in understanding all the questions okay so uh, first of all we will start with number 10. What is um, number uh, 10? The name for it is constant in algebra. And constant is something that doesn't change. Okay, so doesn't change. The next keyword is coefficient. So in this case, we have number two, and number two is coefficient of y. So this is a number of symbol multiplied with a letter. Now we have our uh, constant, we have coefficient, and then we have our letter y. It might be any letter in alphabet, might be D, C, Z, uh, a, B or uh, X. The most common is X, Y, A or B, uh, but it can be any of it. Okay, so our letter Y is unknown and in algebra we say it's a variable. Okay, so this is the letter that represents a number and the number might change or be unknown. Okay, the next keyword is term. In term, is a constant, a variable or a constant multiplied by a variable, okay? So this is the uh, number multiplied by a letter as we have here, 2y. This is a term. Okay, and the last keyword for today is expression. What is expression? So expression is what we have um, what we have in here 10 plus 2y so we have constants coefficients variables terms and what's more we have math operation what is adding in this um, mm, case so this is expression very important expression okay so expression contains one or more numbers one or more letters and one or more operations which is adding, subtracting, multiplying, dividing powers and so on, okay? So another keyword to take it down and remember it, please. We know all the keywords now, but uh, before we go to question, we need to uh, know a few rules as well. So let's start with 5x. What does it mean 5x? In primary school you are using x for multiplication, okay? Now if we want to multiply it we will be using brackets. So 5x, this is 5 is a number, x is a letter. So um, in algebra that means we need to multiply it 5 by x and this is the same as 5 bracket x bracket so we need to multiply it 5 by x okay the next one is 2 plus a so 2 plus a means just uh, to add a okay the next one is b so B is a letter and B uh, might stand for banana. So that means it's just one banana. So this is the same as one B. Okay. And then um, we have the next one. Let's say is minus B. And minus b means minus 1b. 
and this is the same as minus 1 multiplied by b. The next one, let's say it's xy and xy means x multiplied by y and we can also write it down in the brackets so x multiplied by y. The next one, let's say we have three letters x, y, t and this is the same x multiplied by y and multiplied by t. Now a, b, is it the same question mark as b, a? Hmm. Let's say we have numbers 2 multiplied by 3. Is it the same as 3 multiplied by 2? So 2 multiplied by 3, 3 multiplied by 2 is 6. Yeah, we, when we have the numbers it's the same. So the same for letters. We need to remember A, B is exactly the same as B, A. The order is not important. We know that uh, this is multiplication and we can change the order, okay? So very important rule to remember. A, B is the same as B, A. And the last one in here, let's say we have M by Z. So what this line means. So this is division. So we need to remember um, this is M divided by Z. Make sure you have all the keywords in your copy and all the rules in your copy and be prepared for tomorrow, okay? We also will be using uh, order of operations a lot in algebra, so this is really important to know beam does by heart. So, um, qu quick recap, B stands for um, brackets, I for indices and powers, MD for uh, multiplication and division, they are on the same level, the same uh, important as well. So if division is first, we need to do division first. If multiplication is first, we need to do multiplication first. Mm -hmm. And the last level is um, addition and subtraction, the same on the same level, equally important, okay? If um, subtraction is first, well, we need to do it first. If addition is first, we'll do it first, okay? Take it down into your copies as well. Okay, this is the first question. Write uh, each of the following using maths symbols and uh, operations as well. So, as you know, in maths we love symbols and uh, we don't write uh, huge long essays and we just make it as short as possible. So, first one, 2 plus 6 times 10. How can you write it down? So we have 2 plus 6 times uh, x. Okay. 2 plus 6 times x. This is multiplication, 6 times x. So we can also write it down as 2 plus 6. 6 multiplied by x in the bracket, okay? Both of uh, the, the expressions are correct. Next one, y divided by s. y divided by s. And the next one is 5 times y multiplied by 4 times r, okay? So let's break a time. 5 times y. So 5, five times y. We have 5y. And then multiplied by 4 times r. Remember, if you want to multiply it, we use brackets, okay? We don't use x for multiplication anymore. x is a letter, okay? 
And we also can write it down in this form. And it's also correct. So take it down into your copy, please. Question two. Um, we need to uh, write each using words. So we need to be able to read an expression, okay? Read it. What does it mean? So 3b. 3b means 3 multiplied by b. The next one. Torsion c minus 2a. So torsion c more Torsion multiplied by C, take away or minus 2 multiplied by A. And the last one in here is 2 divide, remember this line means divide, by 5 multiplied by X. Let's write it down then. Okay, so for the end, um, you need to be able to explain the keywords you've met today. So you need to know what is coefficient, what is term, what is expression, what is constant variable, and you need to give me example for it. Um, the next thing is remember the rules and remember the the order of operations. Okay, so beam does is essential in here. And the next thing, you need to be able to write an expression down using math symbols and operations and be able to read an expression, okay? You need to know um, what 3x means or uh, 3x plus 5y. Uh, so for today, that's it. See you tomorrow.